Hey, it's Mr. Peace. Just got done sharing my heart for a first time here at St. Simon the Apostle Catholic School in Indianapolis, Indiana. And it's home of the Royals. You can see on the back wall over there, a beautiful morning that I got to share my heart with kindergarten through eighth grade. We had three separate assemblies and the main focus was on bullying, but more importantly, looking at the heart first, right? That you see somebody as you see your best friend and through the eyes and the lens of our Savior, Christ Jesus. So with the crucifix on the wall here, I really try to incorporate the faith element into the, into the assemblies. We talk about how the greatest commandment is to love the Lord your God with all your heart, mind, soul, body. But the second, just like it, is to love your neighbor as yourself. But we have to have that self-love first before we can give it out. And we have to turn any hurt that we have, hurt people who hurt people, into healed people who heal people. And so Isaiah 53 talks about how by his wounds we are healed. And so for him to fully enter our heart, Christ, we can turn this, our heart as big as our fist, into this, into the peace sign, right? One finger ourself, the other trying to lift some up, someone up higher than ourself by how we choose to treat that person, which is hopefully with the same love that our perfect example of perfect love has, has taught all of us. And that we are able to see people for their heart first, and that means 1 Samuel 16, that man, woman, we look at the outward appearance, but God, God looks at the heart. That we have to have that same mentality and that same heart to see people for that, but also see people for this too. So like the front of the shirt says miracle and the lines in each of our hands like traced here. The M stands for miracle, upside down, W for worthy, and that goes to Isaiah 49. I have engraved you in the palm of my hands. This is the proof. We have to buy into that, believe that 110%, because now we have to go be the light for this world, for other people that don't really see that, that can't really really fully love who they are when they look in the mirror, right? We gotta reflect that, that love, that kindness, and be that best friend to all these people, be the miracle, and also show them that they are worthy of love. So as we continue on too, it was really an awesome tie-in to the school-wide theme that they have here at St. Simon, and that's one heart, one mind, and to really have that shown up, not only in the presentation itself, but throughout the school, it's a reminder for these students that Yes, they can look at the heart first, but I think they can now have that uh, connection with my message and, and the one that they see all throughout the building. So like, for example, right outside the gymnasium doors, you'll see one of the signs right here, one heart, one mind. And this also ties into the verse from Acts chapter four, which is all about the idea that we need to share everything right as a community of believers it's not just food and drink it's our love right so thank you for sharing your hearts with me thank you for touching your touching my heart i hope you back again one day until then much love and as always make sure to subscribe by hitting the bell that you'll see pop up on the window hit the link here too to stay up to date for any other future videos like this one on the channel you'll, you'll see another playlist with some other amazing clips along with my website to check out my journey across this country as we continue to heal america's heart one school at a time peace